Manx cat versus Japanese bobtail cat. What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The tailless Manx is the result of a genetic mutation that was then intensified by the cat's remote location on the Isle of Man, off the coast of Britain. The Japanese bobtail breed's telltale characteristic is a short bunny tail that can be flexible or rigid, with one or more curves, angles, or kinks. This is a medium-sized cat weighing 6 to 10 pounds. The Manx is known for his lack of a tail, but not every Manx is completely tailless. Some, known as longies, have a normal length tail, and others, known as stumpies, have short tails. A Manx with no tail is called a rumpy and one with just a rise of bone at the end of the spine is known as a riser. You will see only rumpies and risers in the show ring, but cats with tails can be used in Manx breeding programs. A Manx has other distinguishing characteristics as well, including a round head with large round eyes, a stout, powerful body with a broad chest, a short back and broad, round rear end, short front legs, and long hind legs with muscular thighs. The long rear legs give him the appearance of a rabbit and maybe the source of the cabot myth. The Manx has two different coat lengths, a short double coat or a long haired double coat. The long-haired Manx is called a Kimrick in some cat registries, but the Cat Fanciers Association simply considers the long hair a variety of Manx. In both lengths, the coat comes in many different colors, including various solids, tabbies, tortoise shells, and calicos. Chocolate and lavender colors and the pointed Himalayan pattern are not permitted. Japanese bobtail's telltale characteristic, of course, is a short bunny tail that can be flexible or rigid, with one or more curves, angles, or kinks, ideally extending out from the body no more than 3 inches. The fur fans out to create the look of a pom-pom on a short hair, or a blooming chrysanthemum on a long hair. Each cat in the breed has a unique tail. The Japanese bobtail is known as well for its tricolor calico pattern called Mike meaning 3 fur and pronounced McKay but other popular colors are black and white or red and white. He also comes in solid colors and tortoise shell and tabby patterns. Some cat registries permit pointed or sepia tone coats. Bold, dramatic markings and vividly contrasting colors are a trademark of this breed. The eyes can be any color, including blue or odd-eyed. The silky coat can be short-haired or long-haired. In both lengths, the cats have a little undercoat. Long-haired bobtails may have a ruff around the neck, long fur on the belly, and fur that is noticeably longer on the tail and upper hind legs than it is on the upper part of the body. Some have tufts of fur on the ears and toes. He has a slender but muscular body, long, slender legs that are noticeably longer in the rear, although they are angled in such a way that the body remains level rather than rising up toward the rear, and a finely chiseled head with high cheekbones, large oval eyes set at a slant, and large, upright, expressive ears. The Manx began life as a mouser, and he retains his fine hunting skills and alert nature. With a Manx around the house, you don't need a watchdog, you've got a watch cat who reacts rapidly and will growl threateningly or maybe even go on the attack at the sight or sound of anything out of the ordinary. If he sees that you aren't alarmed, he'll settle back down. When he's not protecting his family and property from mice, stray dogs, or other threats, however, the Manx is a mellow fellow, an even-tempered and affectionate cat who enjoys serene surroundings. That's not to say he isn't active. This is a happy, playful cat who likes to follow his favorite person through the house and assist with whatever he or she is doing. When you are ready to relax, though, the Manx will be in your lap, ready for a comfy nap. If no lap is available, He'll curl up on the nearest available spot that allows him to keep an eye on you. He speaks in a quiet trill and will carry on a conversation if you talk to him. The Manx has an adaptable nature if he is exposed to activity and other people as a young kitten. He will enjoy meeting new people, greeting them with a gentle head butt or cheek rub, and can adapt to a new home or family if such an upheaval in his life is necessary. This is a smart cat who can learn tricks, including fetch and come, and is willing to walk on a leash if taught early. He often likes to ride in the car, making him a great companion on long-distance trips. It's not unusual for the Manx to enjoy playing in the water, he is an island cat, after all, and you may find him turning on faucets or fishing in a fountain. He is also good at learning how to open doors, so be sure anything you don't want him to have is under lock and key. Manx is willing to accept boundaries, and will usually respect your wishes if you tell him no when he jumps on the counter or scratches on your sofa. Just be sure you give him an acceptable alternative as thanks for his nice behavior. The Manx is highly people-oriented. Choose him only if you can give him plenty of time and attention daily. The Japanese bobtail is playful and smart. He will relish the challenge of a rotating assortment of puzzle toys or the fun of chasing a lure on a fishing pole toy. He is very good at learning tricks and will even walk on a leash if he thinks it's a fun thing to do. When you are sitting down, though, expect this friendly feline to find a place in your lap. 
This is an adaptable cat who travels well, making him a good choice for boisterous families or people who enjoy an RV lifestyle. On the downside, he can be headstrong, and it's difficult to change his mind about which things are okay to do and which ones aren't. He is a busy cat and must have companionship people or another bobtail would be his first choice, but a dog will do in a pinch to keep him entertained when you are out earning the money for his food and toys. This is a smart cat who enjoys puzzle toys, learning tricks, and playing fetch. He isn't as vocal as some breeds, but he communicates his pleasure with chirps, clicks and trills, as well as the standard purr and meow. Hello! This video is sponsored by BMix Pets. Are you looking for high-quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. The soft, short coat of the Manx is easily cared for with weekly brushing or combing to remove dead hair and distribute skin oil. Because the Japanese bobtail has a little undercoat, both the short-haired and long-haired varieties are very easy to groom. Tangles are uncommon, and a weekly combing will remove dead hairs. Both long hairs and short hairs shed seasonally. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Trim the nails every couple of weeks. Wipe the corners of the eyes with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. Keep the litter box spotlessly clean. Cats are very particular about bathroom hygiene. It's a good idea to keep them as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Cats who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such a beautiful cat without paying for it. They are a great match for families with kids because he shares their high energy levels. They are up for anything, from playing fetch to being a guest at a tea party to being dressed up in doll clothes and paraded around in a baby buggy. Always supervise children to make sure they pet and play with the cat nicely, and don't pull his ears or twist his tail. They are happy to live with cat-friendly dogs, too, thanks to their amiable and fearless disposition. Introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.